Who are you eating at Christmas? Who are you eating at Christmas time? Do you think that would offend people? I think it would. Excuse me, mate. Do you know where there's uh, the koala? We put koalas, a bunch of koalas, in the same position as the chickens right now. Just strung up by their feet, electric bath, decapitated. What can you do? God's put animals on this earth for us to eat. Except koalas. I'll put it up. All right, we're in Pitt Street Mall here in Sydney. We've got animal rights legend Andy Faulkner here from SavePoppy.com. We are about to ask people, would you eat a koala? Because everyone eats uh, these animals here. We want to see if they would warm to the idea of eating a little fuzzy koala and ask them why not to open up the animal rights discussion. Let's go. Excuse me, would you eat a koala? Christmas koala roast, if I made it for you? Fresh out the tree? Would you eat a koala, mate? Uh, toasted. So the taste is good? Yeah. Toasted, munchies. Something, yeah. yeah. Right. Not, not bad? Yeah. Not bad? Yeah. Not bad? Yeah. No worries. Definitely not. Yeah. Why not? Why not? Why not? You eat national other... National treasure. What about kangaroos? Would you eat a kangaroo? Yeah. Yes. You'd eat a kangaroo? They're, they're a national treasure. Come on. Australian icon animal. They eat kangaroos here. I don't. You don't? No. Wait, what about, what about uh, lamb? Do you eat a lamb? That's a Welsh icon. <laughs> what are you doing? We're in Australia. You're in Australia? <laughs> oh, it depends. It depends. Is it alive? Yeah, no, they have to be killed in order to be eaten. Like how you would have a steak like lamb, or like a lamb. Oh yeah, probably. So you would eat, eat yeah. a koala? Yeah, probably. No, no moral issue with killing koalas? What about uh, lambs? Yeah. Everyone oh, I feel lambs. like this is a yeah. trap. This is a huge trap. Are These ladies are like, <laughs> lambs? Yes. I'm Who are you eating at Christmas? Who are you eating at Christmas time? Who would I eat at Christmas? Who do we eat at Christmas with your family? Uh, what do you eat, like a, a pig? Uh, turkey and, and pig. And uh, pig. Turkey and pig. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, what's the moral? What? Don't forget seafood. What's, seafood the well. what's the moral difference? What's the moral difference? Koala and a turkey. Koalas were here first. Oh, uh, well, come on, that's not a good argument. I wouldn't do it for the moral side of it. Okay. Like, so, what about the other animals like chickens? Yeah, I guess it's not, if they're responsibly farmed. Oh, responsibly? So, yeah. if we, okay, let me ask you this. If we responsibly farm koalas, that'll be alright then? Yeah, I guess so. Well, no. Okay, and why not? With chickens. Like, it's not okay to eat chickens either then. I don't know. Or other animals. Let's say pigs killed in gas chambers, you know that, right? Let's seriously. Yeah. It's CO2 gas chambers where they struggle in the gas chamber. That's cool. And uh, cows are killed in a knockbox, their bolt gun in the head, head yeah. cut off. I did not know that. You didn't know that? I didn't know that. Wow. Well, you can watch a movie called Dominion and find yeah. out how the animals that in the supermarket or in the butchers are, yeah. you know, exploited and killed. Yeah. But when you think of like a koala or say like a dog or... Yeah. People eat kangaroos here. Yeah. But when you think of those animals, it kind of yeah. puts it in perspective. Yeah. I see you have a kangaroo here, but do you have uh, any koalas meat? Can you order us this or no? I don't no. think so. This is okay. Okay. Okay, thank you. Do they have a kangaroo or koalas for uh, meat? Maybe kangaroo. No, koalas meat. Do they got you got sell kangaroos or koala meats here in the butcher section? We'll be on the other side next to the meat. Oh, thank you. Hey, brother, do you know where there's uh, kangaroo or koalas meat in there? No, 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 no. Is there any uh, kangaroo koalas meat? Kangaroos. Kangaroo meat is over there. Any koalas? Hello, I'm just looking for. Do you, can you get any koala meat? I looked in the butcher section, they can't order in. I looked, it's not there. Okay, no. thank you, thank you. It depends on the situation. Alright, tell me. Survival situation, I'll eat one any time of the day. Okay. okay. But like, just to go and eat one, I wouldn't. Okay, what? Tell just, me. I don't look at koalas that way. I like, I've grown up eating other animals. Like who? Like chickens, pigs, all the other stuff, like okay. cows. Cows, yeah, yeah. Like we see that as food, like people have grown up generations killing those animals and eating yeah, yeah, yeah. them. Would you eat a koala? Why, why is that? Um, what would be wrong with eating a koala? See, I get what you're saying because it's like the vegetarian argument. Um, <laughs> wow, I didn't even have to do anything. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I Because you see them as, you know, furry, cuddly animals and, you know, we don't see that like pigs and cows the same way. Okay, so, I so it's about how them. we view them Yeah. that gives them moral value. Yeah, I don't think it's right, but I think that's what happens. But that's what happens. Yeah. But it's not a, would you say, like, I might think he's cute and cuddly, I might think you not so much, or the other way around maybe. <laughs> that's not a moral justifier to like treat you unequally to, to no, Annie, is it? No, 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 no. Look, I'd probably try it. What about a dog? Would you eat a dog? Nah, I wouldn't eat a dog because I think I'm like, like with like, made them like pets you know we've, we've we've gotten to the point where like we have a connection with them but like a koala bra why do you why would you have a connection with a dog because I don't, I don't know that's just humanity dude is there something about the dog that we should care about 
uh, no. So if I booted like a dog, who cares? Yeah, well, like, I think if you booted a koala, it'd be like, uh, if you like booted a Like, if I booted dog, a koala right now, full blast, like everyone would, would you be like, care oh, about that f***, you know? If you ask a koala and, and to ask a chicken, yeah. if you could ask them, do either of you want to be killed and eaten? Yeah. What do you think the answer would be? I would say no. For both of them? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Because, like, let's just say, like, just finally, because I don't know what you're doing at Christmas time, but it's Christmas, like, happening right now. Yeah. And a lot of people sit down to a centerpiece, like a turkey or a pig, Yeah. Like I used to eat. All types of animals. Yeah. If it was a koala in the centre, do you think that would offend people? I think it would. So it's like, nothing about that animal that deserves moral consideration. It's just that, you know, it's okay to kick some. Who cares? Cut koala's heads off. Don't yeah, worry about it. Yeah. All right. Oh, I, I, can't, I can't really. This is not going to really work I'm, on you, I'm mate. Not, I'm not, Are you like a vegan? Oh, well, I'd be pretty hypocritical if I ate other animals and was asking people not to eat koalas. Oh, right. Look, I, I, I just... I'd, I'm open to trying it. I'm not a vegan. <laughs> I was vegan. Too late, mate. I was vegan. Too late. <laughs> Excuse me. Do you have a kangaroo or koalas here? Okay. What's a koala? Roast. Excuse me. Do you know where is koala? Koala meat? I never see koala meat. Yeah. Excuse me, mate. Do you know where there's uh, the koala or koala or kangaroo? It's kangaroo but knows no koalas? No? Why not? We've got crocodile, we've got kangaroo, we're looking for koala, but if, you won't sell it in Australia at all. No, alright. They're red. Alright, thank you. What do you think yeah. most people would think? What do you think I'm gonna have, how much luck you think I'm gonna I get? think you're gonna get the same answers of people no. being like, no, but then they're not gonna be able to really justify why. Maybe I'll ask them if it's okay if I farm them and put them in the slaughterhouses with the pigs, maybe yeah. they might think it's okay. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> if we put koalas, a bunch of koalas in the same position as the chickens right now, you would have a, you know, they get strung up by their feet, electric bath, decapitated. What can you do? Yeah, but like if we put koalas in that position, would you have a moral issue with it? No, I wouldn't care. You wouldn't care? But if we put people in that position, you would care. People is a different story. Why? Tell me. The way we can cu communicate with other humans. It's just... Some don't... humans can't communicate though, yeah? Yeah, but that's different. You like know what babies, I mean? You know what I mean? Little babies yeah. can't communicate. They grow up to learn. They do. Okay, but what about people with a... They never can grow to... You know, they've got a disability, for example. They can... Would we, should we protect them, people? We protect them, we do. Okay, and... In our society, we do to protect so those people. So, if it's not, it's not the fact that they can't communicate that makes them... Just, mo we see it as different, in a different perspective. Like, humans and humans shouldn't eat each other. Maybe not yourself, but if someone yeah. were to have an issue with killing a koala, yeah. they should also extend that same consideration to the other animals. Oh, f yeah. It, Otherwise, what would they be if they didn't? Yeah, that's, that's why I'm saying I would be open to eat a koala because I'm already eating, like, a cow, you don't you want know? to be... Yeah, you want to be consistent. Yeah, But yeah. then you should also eat humans. Or like a dog, yeah, I get you your point. You should also eat humans if you want to be consistent. So it's not con you're not consistent. There's a yeah. certain point where you say, no, that's wrong. Right, yeah. Then it's humans and dogs for you. Fair enough. I wouldn't eat a koala, because like, I've never ate it, so I wouldn't eat it. But like, I would eat like other, like, other animals. Eat. Yeah, like, Do you think meat, you're a like bit of a hypocrite? Do you think Me? you're a bit of a hypocrite, like, for that? No, not really, because like, I'm not eating koalas. That's koalas. You're not talking about other animals. No, but I'm saying, like, for the same reason you wouldn't eat a koala, shouldn't you also extend that to the other animals who oh. feel the same pain, they're sentient? God's put animals on this earth for us to eat them. Except koalas. I'll put it up. <laughs> Would you eat koalas? Uh, probably not, mate. Why not? Do you care about koalas? I do. And if someone killed them and ate them, would you care? Uh, yeah, I would. Do you eat other animals? Uh, Who are you eating at Christmas? Oh, no. What animals are you eating uh, at Christmas? No, no, no. He felt it. He felt it. Tofu, You're eating tofu? Tofurky, you mean. Tofurky. Oh, wow, that's very, very convenient, actually. Would you eat a koala? I uh, would actually, yeah. You would, really? Yeah, I would. What, vegan koala? No, Beans? full, full on uh, koala. koala. I don't know, yeah, wow. Okay. Uh, <laughs> this is it's a weird vegan that yeah, would eat yeah. a koala. There <laughs> you go, mate. I'm good. Good to see you. Yeah, thank you for all your work. No, thank you, thank you. So just a couple of animals though, just two or three, not all of no. them. So not dogs, dogs weren't put here to eat. You see, all around the country, all around the world, bro, you see any it's animals. It's interesting, because you know these animals aren't naturally occurring animals. They're humanly, human selectively bred animals, so they're nothing to do with God. They're human made animals. So humans put them here, there for hey, you to eat. Hey, humans done that, what can we do about it, bro? It's the ones that, once they get Stop paying for it. Once they get, okay, that's not gonna change anything, they're still gonna get killed. But you don't, yeah, yeah but no. people are still gonna get killed, I don't go out and kill people. It's still gonna happen, but yeah. I don't do it, because it's about your moral code. Just, I don't know, bro, we're the difference. Good talking to you, brother. Good to you. Maybe you should go vegan, mate.
No way. How, how, how do you dispatch it? How would you what? How do you gain all my muscle? Well, I've... I mean, I, I can get vegan, just do weights and eat more calories, and you, you can get enough protein as a vegan. But how long would that take? Same same amount of time. Like just you know, no, no way. At a certain threshold, you get enough you protein. Your protein, you need macros, you need all this stuff, bro. Can I ask you a question? How have you got muscles, like if you're vegan? I right? don't know. I guess my body just synthesizes the plant protein out of air. Yeah, yeah, out of air. Because I thought be you only air. eat basically air sticks. Maybe a few leaves. Yeah, yeah. You know? yeah. I didn't think they had protein. It's all just plants. Yeah, I mean, I just, um, I just eat grass. I'll be honest. With you. Yeah. Koalas eat gum leaves, don't they? Eucalyptus leaves, Ooh. and they've got protein. It's, yeah, cross it's magic. Yeah, yeah. They must be on the juice. <laughs> Tofu, tempeh, beans, legumes full of protein, whole grains. Mm. You can get mock meats as well, full of protein. Vegans aren't dying of protein deficiency. That's yeah, for sure. I know. I know you're, I know you're vegan, and everything, but like nothing's gonna stop me for eating meat. Like, like God put the meat, but like. Uh, eat it, like what can I do? If you can watch a movie for me called Dominion, you and your mates, hey brother. Because this, this will blow your mind, man. There's a bunch of activists that leave cameras in these places, in Australia actually. So then you can see the truth for yourself, you know what I mean? And it's f***ed up. It's the most f***ed thing I've ever seen. What happens in Australia to animals. Um, you don't watch, I'll watch it. It's all right. Promise me, brother. How old are you? 17. 17, bro. When I was 17, uh, you seem you had your head screwed on a lot more than me at that age. I was. A, menace all right i was a menace i was running around i was carrying knives i was drinking alcohol I was taking drugs in on the streets all the time yeah so to have this conversation i wish i had this conversation when i was 17 now all right brother take care, take care bro no worries good talking to you i can't i can't just walk away without a selfie